Yeah, and he never survived. He just had to walk around for the rest of his life with his fingers stuck up his butt. Wow. Yeah, it was it's crazy. Permanent. What's going on, guys? Welcome to another Chaos Draft here on Magic the Gathering Online. Seven out of eight. Seems good. Seems good. You gonna be measuring? Mm -hmm. Oh, I like this guy. I mean, at worst, it's a removal spell. At best, it's a five-six floaty boy. You destroy a non-demon creature at the beginning of your upkeep. If there are fewer than six creatures, you sack a creature. So, I mean, even if you sack like a worse creature, this set was actually pretty good. Mark of the Vampire is nice. Uh, Voracious Worm and his battlefield with X plus one with X and around life you gain this turn. That could be decent. Put a 1-1 one -one counter if you control a beast. This guy can get real good. Oh, no, you put a counter on a, on a beast every turn, which is real good. I'm pretty sure it's just 5-6. Is that your name? Are we? Nope. Okay. I don't know what it was then. That's weird. Probably the cat. If any of these come back, then we can just go back into black, black blue, which is really where you want to be. Ooh, acidic slime. Dang. And then we're black green again. That's not terrible. I think it's. I think it was terrible. We we didn't actually open very good picks, and we kind of the wheels kind of came off a little bit. Ponder is also good. You take the ponder. This is nice because it deals with like those obnoxious artifacts and enchantments, though, which sometimes you just don't get a way to deal with. I kind of like acidic slime here. Yeah, that's kind of what I like too. All right, we're doing it. Also, if you guys are interested, check out MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. You'll get 15% off along with free shipping and free returns. And uh, they're super comfortable. Mike knows because he doesn't he doesn't actually wear them. But they're they're pretty comfortable. And I think anyone in the chat who has purchased them is, uh, is has been satisfied. Bolster 3. I like a typhoid, right? Bolster 3 seems amazing. Who has Bolster 3? Oh. Oh, that's actually interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. A lot of five drops in this pack. Five drop, five drop, four drop. Typhoid Rat's probably pretty good. It's a nice early creature. Snake is OP? Was there a snake I missed? I also like cash defenses is not bad. I do like the rat. Because especially if we ever get to live the dream with the Viridian Longbow, it's just nice. Stomach's rumbling now. Hi, Karamba. Uh, 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 I, Karamba. Also, this is an easy creature to go in the graveyard so the Shadowborn Demon doesn't die. Or require any more, f any more food. Wonderwine Prophet. Champion of Merfolk. Whenever it deals damage to a player, you may sacrifice Merfolk. You need to take an extra turn after this one. I don't foresee us being that Merfolk heavy, I'll be honest. He's a combo boy. He was a combo boy. He said, gonna combo you. Wow. Amazing. Combo boy. Nasa Elite is alright. It's 4-2. They all gotta block that dude. I'm reluctant to take another five drop, but this is not great without fairies and I, Moongle of Extract's all right. Pepper, pepper smoke. Pepper, pepper, pepper smoke. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> so Goblin Nick in the chat sends me actually some of the actual best, uh, some of the actual best memes, and he just sent this one over. Uh, that's pretty good. Uh, that's a solid, well, solid meme to be quite honest. So, good times. When this enters the battlefield, we return to two lands from your graveyard to your hand. How are they going to get there? Come on, let's be real. We ain't retracing anything. Uh, you choose a green or white creature from it. No. This Draw is all card if you have no cards in hand. Huh. Huh. 
Two two for four with fear and persist. So it's a two two and because of one one. I mean that's probably the best card in here. Also, it's actually good to sacrifice for the Shadowborn Demon. I'll take that guy. That guy's fine. Sacrifice me for your Shadowborn Demon. Five six. Uh, what is this? Sacrifice it. Search your library for an island card, a swamp card, and a mountain card. Reveal those cards and put them into your hand. So it just search for three basics, and we don't. We're not playing two of those colors. I'll just take the five six. Man, your birthday does inspire. It does. It does spark joy. Hmm. 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 Did uh, Did Felipe have any uh, food preferences or suggestions? Of course not. Okay. Well, three, three for four. Sacrifice to put a land on top of its owner's library. No. Three, four for six. Reach when you cast a spirit against force. Oh Jesus, that's terrible. One, two for two. When it dies, create a one, one spirit token for each Zubira that died this turn. That's just a one, two that makes a one, one. That's also pretty good. Because, again, it goes well with the demon. With the demon. When, when it dies, each player loses three life. What hell is with the, what is actually wrong with you? You know that song? I have no idea what you just sang. No. I want chips and salsas now. Just a, you want uh, chips and salsas? I want the uh, chips and salsas. Uh, well, I forgot Pharaohs. It just deals one damage to target creature planeswalker. Oh, you gotta control a desert to do that? No. Oh, wow. Well. What's wrong with you? I don't know. Nothing. It's nothing. probably my gingivitis. It's probably my gingivitis. Gingivitis. Nothing came back from this pack. That's really sad. Sure. At the beginning of the upkeep of Enchanted Creatures Controller, that player loses one whole life point. Wow. Man, what a killer card. It's not, though. Boaster boy. Actually, if we play this on one and then we play this, it's actually a 4-4 four, four flyer. That's actually not the worst deal I've ever seen. Uh, They're called Creature Lands, Bowser. Come on. Get it together. Are you picking your nose? Nope. <laughs> Scratching my face. Can you only feel like creature's toughness and they discard that card? No, that's just so narrow. This is actually probably playable, maybe. It's a lure, right? All, all creatures will block and do so. That's actually not bad. <laughs> Asking for a friend. Oh, man. What's wrong with you? What's this mood you're in, man? You're just being really weird. And you're not contributing anything. You're just saying nonsense. Isn't that all I ever do? No, sometimes you actually contribute. Contribute your face. There you go. Got you him. literally just, in response to me saying that, you literally just did it again. That's good. That's very good. Got him. Fester Hard Board 3 3. It's actually 5 5 if someone thing died. Yeah, I don't care about that. Don't care about you. Don't the care. The board is decent. I know, I'm just checking the other cards. God, why are you like this? Got him! Ooh, Mark of the Vampire. Ooh, that was good. I was hoping the other one came back. Also, Vanquish the Weak. Destroy a creature with power three or less. That's probably better, right? Maybe Mark will come back again this time. Air Elemental, too. God dang. Don't fall the trap. Why the not? blue trap. The blue trap was the name of the bar I was opening up. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. What is this thing? That's from the Pokemon trailer. No, it's not. <laughs> it really is. What? Yeah, it's from the new Pokemon, the Pokemon movie, the P Detective Pikachu. That's actually from the trailer because that looks yeah that looks terrible. <laughs> it's it's amazing. Uh, I want to take Harabi's Whisper, destroy a target non-black creature for three mana. Just gas. Need to watch this trailer, apparently. We'll watch it after. When I'm downloading Bumblebee from the internet. This is from the Blizzard campus, just so you know. Look at all these pets. Oh my god. When I went to when I went into the campus tour when I was at BlizzCon, my friend Mike showed me the campus and 
Um, there were dogs everywhere in all the buildings, and I was like, this is just amazing. I can't even handle this. Like, everyone had dogs in the actual offices. It was just ridiculous. 7-7 seven, seven for 7. It's f probably fine. 1-1 one, one for 2. 1-1 one, one for 1. 1-1 one, one for 2. Like, none of these other cards are any good. Uh, when it's turn face up, return all zombie cards from all, from all graveyards to the zone. Yeah, no, we're just going to take the, the fat boy. The Great Aurora? Each player shuffles oh, all yeah. cards from their hand and all permanents they own into their library, then draws that many cards. Each player may put any number of land cards from their hand. The Great Aurora. Huh. Uh, that's a removal spell, kind of. Consecrated by blood. Enchanted chips plus two plus two is flying. Sacrifice two other creatures to regenerate this. Really? For four mana? Well, actually, four mana. This is literally just Shiv's Embrace, right? But, I mean, instead of pumping, you get to possibly regenerate it. Plus two, plus two, and flying is actually pretty good. I also like Eyeblight Assassin a lot, and I like Orchard Spirit a lot. This is actually... I'm going to take the Spirit. Really? Mm-hmm. Over the consecrated by blood? Mm-hmm. Now I'm gonna float over. We all float down here, Michael. Um, Crumbly Colossus attack, sacrificing on the combat. Hmm. No, sir, I don't like it. Titanic growth seems fine. Over to such boy. It's a five man. Like how many more five drops you want? Seven. Okay. Well, I wish. I, sometimes I really do wish I could get a, an honest answer out of you, though. Like that is. Five five drops is totally fine. Wouldn't you rather have one combat trick or a two drop? Maybe. It's too late. I took it. Here's a naturalized. Here's a murderer's axe. You ever used one of these before? No. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you ask me that? This card can actually get out of hand. Whenever they try to kill something else, you just sack your idiots. Also, we have the dripping tongue, which is two guys, and the lingering tormentor, which is two guys. This is probably the pick. No. No. All right, now we take a Zemek Guild Mage, and then this comes nope. back, and then we get to splash the blue, right? No. Nope. <laughs> no. Nope. Just stop it. What does this guy do? 2-2, two, two, when it becomes blocked, if any player discards. Okay. Can't be blocked except by creatures with reach or flying. That's actually also pretty good with cash defenses. And we already have um, Acidic Slime, so I don't think we're... Nope, don't care about that. Whenever the human dies, like we have no humans, right? Like we probably have maybe one, one human, maybe, and I doubt that. Yeah, we have zero humans. All right, so this card's just a literal two, two for three. Which isn't the greatest thing. It's not a good rate. Plus one, plus oh. Whenever a creature completes block, the shark creature can't be regenerated. Whatever. <laughs> Spire Tracer was that's literally what I thought when you said that because I was like oh I missed uh, Define Elf with cash defenses so I'll take the Spire Tracer because of the cash defenses see I appreciate that that was a good heads up you gave me there it is Chaos Drafto Sensing later on as Michael B. It's a Michael B. song. Oh, the Mark of the Vampire came back. I like it. How deep are we going on these? I don't think there's that much removal in these in this format because you're just like opening three different packs, and that's why. That's all I got. It's lol K random. Lol K random. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mom's low okay, random. Got him. Did you guys hear me? Did you hear me get him? He got wrecked. That dude got shrecked. Uh, look. Look at all these tiny little guys. Whatever, I'll take the trample. Hey man, bolster. Yeah, that's what I, was, I mean, right. Yeah, it's just 4-4. Four, 4-4 four. Four, four trampler. Broken. Why on time? <laughs> oh, Lord. That's fantastic. 
Sorry, I just saw a little, like, there's a little joke on a website. Oh, man. Oh, Eldritch Evolution. It's two, right? So if we had a five, we can actually sack, like, the Acidic Slime into a normal Spaloth or Basswood Gorger. That's not terrible. Yes. Uh, <laughs> a yeast. Also, this seems great because we have, like, all these, like, Lingering Tormentor, Dripping Tongue Zubera, all these cards that give us value when we sacrifice them. I kind of like it of the Horrid Swarm a little better. Like, so this is, what, seven? So we can actually pay it for three and sack the Tormentor to make a 4-4 four, four and two one ones. That seems good. Yeah, that seems pretty sweet. This also seems good. Shrill Howler is also nice. Yeah, I'm gonna take this guy. This guy seems good with what we have. Plague Wind. That's a good one. Oh yeah, we're 100 percent taking Plague Wind. Like we're not taking Lone Wolf or Drudge Skeletons here. We're, we're Plague Wind and for sure. Not even close. We're Plague Wind and keep on rolling. I would like some ramp. If I can get like a rampant growth or like a far seek or something, I'd be really thrilled about that. Mississippi Moon, won't you keep on Michael on me? Keep on Michael on me. Is everything. Make it Michael right. Oh, it's Michael. Keep on Michael. Michael, Michael, Please, Michael, just Michael, Michael. Send it on. I'm just. I like Dark Bargain. I like Death Bloom Thalad, and I also like Skittering Surveyor. Don't you mean Dark Bargle? I was gonna say Dark Bargle. Wow. Oh man, I think it actually is Surveyor. It's just a draw one here, and it helps get that land. Oh, when this enters the battlefield, you search your library for basic land, put it on the battlefield, tap. That is a ramp, sir. Fortuitous find is nice because you can get a creature and an artifact, but we don't have any. Like whatever, I'm just gonna get the rampy boy. Oh, this deck is looking nice. So we have Flyer that can't block for one, and we have... Can't be blocked except by creatures with flying. I think we'd actually take the Elf out and play... We might just play these two because of the cash defenses. They're also nice to have to sacrifice the Shadowborn or to just help make this guy one cheaper. I don't think that's great, but... Oh, we also have, like, enchantments, though. So I think it's all fine. <laughs> Whenever if a creature you control with toughness four or greater dies, each opponent loses two and you gain two. We don't have that many of those. We have Fester Hide Boar. Uh, Demon. Uh, we have like six. Five or six. Sacrifice another creature, put a one on counter on this dude. This is a three one for two. Give it a creature trample to on turn. More. Might just be Hooting Mandrels, actually. Hooting Mandrels is great. They are Hooting. Hooting mandrels, they are hooting. Hooting mandrels, they are hooting. Good Apparently call. John Cena's in this. Yeah. Hmm. You can't see him though, so it doesn't matter. Wow. <laughs> Ooh, Tretchy Boy. 4-4, four, 4-4, four, 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 four Flyer for, for 5. Whenever it attacks or blocks, sacrifice unless you exile a card from your graveyard. As long as you have 7 or more cards in your graveyard, it gets a plus 2, plus 2, and has when it dies, you lose 6 life. It's still a 4-4 four, four flyer. Yeah, but a weird ability. Why? What's weird about it? You got exile cards in your graveyard. Who cares? Why do we need those? Yeah, but what if you run out? Then you're doing, then you're boned. Mike Mike needs a nappy poo. Mike's whole life is needing a nappy poo. Grave Scrabbler is great, but we don't really have a way to discard it. Deep Cavern Imps is great, but we don't really have a way to take advantage of the discard. Destroy Enchanted Permanent. Enchant Artifact Enchanted. Big Arab Keep, choose one. Destroy Enchanted Permanent or gain two life. Oh, that's interesting. So you can put this on an enchantment. You can gain two life, gain two life, gain two life, then destroy it. Hmm. Fascinating. Do we have any way? Do, any, do we have any discard outlets? No. A lot of sacrifice outlets. Still just gonna take it just in case. I think it's better than Deep, Ca Deep Cavern Imp. Ooh, Crawl Warrior is a great pickup here. We need more two drops anyway. This is a good one. 
Now I need more cuts, Michael. What are we cutting? Your face. <sighs> Crying out loud. Guys, I hope you really appreciate that. I think we're just going to cut the one drops here, except for the typhoid rats. Cause yeah, it's probably best. They're not great with cash defense. We already have 16 creatures, so. I do like this deck a lot better than the previous one. Cut your face. Oh, the Shrill Howler came back? Wow, that's great. I'm a fan of that dude. Flipping it over, creatures of power less than Howling Chorus can't block. So it's a 3-5 that they get that's hard to block. And whenever it deals damage to a player, that you get a 3-2 Eldrazi Horror, which is pretty sweet. Wow, look at this red-white pack. But now we need one more cut, so I don't know what to do. Cut the Surveyor. Are you serious? We have like two 6-drops, a 7-drop, and an 8-drop, and a 9-drop. And you want to cut one of the cards that literally just draws us a land? Oh, it does something that it didn't do what I thought it did. What did you think it did? What, what did you think it was? I Which thought it just put a land from your, a land from your hand into. Oh, into play. Play. Oh yeah, that's pretty bad. That's no bueno. I think we can maybe cut one of these for the dark bargain though. I like drawing two. So plus two, plus two, and life link, or, or plus two, plus two, and flying, and, and sack two creatures yeah. to regenerate. Which is not actually out of the realm. We have like yeah, life link's pretty strong though. I agree. I do like the life link a little bit better. Team Recharger is actually not unplayable. It's a 3 1 for 2. Whenever a player discards a card, you may pay 2. If you do, you may tap for. That's. that's Why is that. No. 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 I need 2 cuts? Yeah, I don't like it. It's getting worse. It might just be cash defenses. Yeah, I could see. If that. this is an instant, I'd be 100% about it, but. Like, it's, it's hard because you can't control it. It just goes on the creature with the least toughness. And it's a sorcery, so. Yeah, let's cut it. One more cut. Or you just play 41, which I'm fine with. That's what I'm doing. What is this Crypt of the Eternal? Oh, that's the uh, Grixis land. Yeah. 8-8. Eight, eight. Uh, let's go 9-8. Oh, imagine defense is on a shrilled howler. Yeah, but he'll never have the lowest toughness unless it's like the only... I guess... No, I guess that's... I guess the first half, yeah. The first half would definitely get it. I like that a lot, but I don't actually know what I'd cut, though. Everything else in the deck seems really good. Cut Lingering Tormentor. That guy's great. It's a 2-2 two -two fear, and then it persists. Which means we can sacrifice this, we can sacrifice this twice, like... You can put... Oh, you guys... Multiple people are saying it? Oh, you were just reading that. Mm -hmm. Oh. I mean, I like it because you can also put, like, Mark and then it has Fear. It's an evasive guy with, with lifelink. A wild and crazy evasive guy. It's a, it's a wild and crazy evasive guy. Yeah, that's, that's accurate. Cut the MB? Oh my god. Oh my god. What about the 7-7 seven, seven for 7? You don't like that guy? I mean, I do, but... It's just a fat bottom fat bottom beast. It makes the rock and world go around. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yep, yeah, these nuts is right. These nuts is right. Michael, Michael, his name is Michael. Michael, Michael. You're like, how close are you going to get, man? What's the significance of that book? This is the first appearance of Annihilus, which you can see right here. I don't know who that is. He is a Fantastic Four villain. Well, I gathered that much. Oh, wow, because you're, you're so smart, right? Wow. Yeah. Cool. Exactly. Cool, dude. Why don't you brag about it? It's king size, you know. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, good times, good times. It's like a Snickers bar, you see. Signed by Stan. Wow. That's a good one. That's a solid, 
Solid bucko. Did we not play? Oh god, I'm like waiting. We playing or I was like, god, I still do it to this day. Once I submit my deck and hit save, I just wait for the round to start. I, I'm so bad about that. Sorry, guys. I think it's like, these guys are just looking at comics off the screen. Yeah, I was. Because I thought we were good to go. Eh, whatever. One swamp. I'll take it. How? No, I got nothing. How I Got Nothing by Michael B. <laughs> How I Got Nothing, the Michael B story. Okay, no swamp still. But if we hit any land and then play this, then we can go play this, and then we're going to sack things every turn. Did that robot start again? Yeah, every every 6 p.m. on Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. One time, we did it. I went to a shooting range for the first time this past weekend and did a pistol training course. They had Stanley's picture on the wall, so I asked him about it. Turns out he also did firearms training there. Surprised. Oh, that's awesome. What a weird... What a weird little tidbit there. Never didn't have it. John Bernathal as well? Do I prefer MTGO Arena? Uh, it depends on what we're doing. I prefer MTG. Why did they activate that? And then... <laughs> that was strange. Uh, if we're... Oh, it had to be charged. That's really sad. Um, actually, we could just play Acidic Slime and kill this thing, right? Yeah, that seems pretty good. Um, I mean, it's just what we're doing. Like, if I'm playing Modern or Cube, then I prefer MTGO because, obviously, it's the only client that has those formats. If I'm playing standard or drafting, I probably just prefer Arena because I like the way it handles those things better. Oh, wow. I do not like the new Mulligan rule. Really? Mm. I like it because it's a change, and I like things... I like change. So, I'm hoping... The one was perfect. Um, It still leaves a lot of games where you're just like... Because if you go to, like, four cards, like, you're just keeping it because it's four cards. Like, a lot of the time it doesn't matter. And play this and then nothing. I'm willing to four. It um, doesn't matter either way, right? Well, yes, it does because you still draw seven cards in the new system. So you get to pick the best four cards. Yeah, that's true. So if you're playing a deck like Tron, you can literally go like two Tron pieces, Sylvan Scrying, Karn, you know? And all you need to do is hit a forest to the third Tron piece or whatever. Like, I mean, it, I'm not trying to support Tron, but I'm saying like it does. Looking at four cards and choosing to keep rather than looking at seven and picking the best four is definitely feels better. That might be too good, though. I, I wonder that as well. So this is going to go up two to six. Is there a way we can... Yeah, I guess we can play Festerhide Boar and Typhoid Rats. Hi, do you have that new mulligan rule? My friend plays draw. <laughs> Yeah, my friend, uh, he wants to know if you can have the if if you could substitute the Impossible Burger for that. Oh, that's cool. You played a Vraska and then you played a Wrath of God afterwards. Must be after nice. After I killed your rare artifact. Seems very good. You're doing very good. One, <laughs> two, three. Well, let's try to prevent you from getting an emblem, I guess. I like it as a person who has to mulligan a lot. That's that's a funny thing to say. Man, I got a mulligan all the time. As such, I enjoy this change. Yeah, it's hot, hot, hot. God, I'm so tired. This card is so... These cards are so ridiculous, dude. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like, I'm just like, fingers crossed that you don't get another thing. Fingeals crossed. Can you not talk about my fingeals, Michael? How do you feel about color splashes and hardened module? I, I have no idea. Hardened modular? Is it just called... Are you talking about hardened scales? Because no one calls it hardened modular. Don't be weird. I 
I just don't feel like the deck really needs it. Like, I mean, if you splashed anything, you'd probably be white for the sideboard cards, but the deck just seems very strong as it is. I am weird. Okay, I, I accept. Uh, yep, yeah, we gotta sacrifice the dude. I'll sacrifice Zubera. Zubera, Zubera. Oh my god, when you look like that. Zubera, make a new man. You know. I don't. You know the one. And then we're just going to play Tretchy. Big Tretchy. Uh, that is a 15 hour stream we're going to be doing next week. So. Keep your fingjeels crossed. Not that innocent. Oh, wow, they sacrificed this? Well, that, that solves that problem, doesn't it? Is this fucking serious? Are you serious? Wow. Terminus, Austere Command, and Vraska. Cool. Well, guess I can't beat the Planeswalker Double Wrath deck. And you happen to have two zombies in your graveyard. Seems good. That's insane. Yeah, I don't... This is pretty pretty ridiculous, actually. I'm waiting for the day Mike falls asleep and actually bangs his head on the desk. Same. Same. Oh, wow. Destroy a non-black creature, huh? Well, fear, huh? Well, yeah, I'm just going to go to the next game. They have an active Vraska and three cards in hand to our two cards. It's pretty just absolutely miserable. Cool, thanks for showing me that. Good to know. We have packs to stain. Interesting. Well, that's a thing, I guess. Yeah, Tormentor definitely seems worse now, sure. You okay, man? You, you literally fall asleep? No. Your eyes look heavy as as as, as hell, dude. <laughs> it's because they weigh a ton. Alright. Uh plus plus one death touch and recommend to lose two life. I don't want to play like cash defenses because then they just wipe the board and it's just worse. Yeah, that's a good point. I don't think we're really bored in anything. Give me a sign. Oh, yes. Oh, I guess we could have just played it as is, huh? Hmm. Well, I'm like, no, I need a 41st card. Burp, 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 burp. Was that your mom? Man, I thought we were doing really good because we were able to, like, turn four our guy to ramp, turn five acidic slime, their haunted mail, and then they're like, no, nah, wipe the board. Here's a Vraska. Wipe the board again. And I'm like, okay, well, I guess that's that. Shut up and take my money. Okay. One heavier are the eyes that wear the crown book. Wow. <laughs> yeah, aren't they, though? Aren't they? Shut up and take my money. I have missed the stream. I can't wait to see what wacky hijinks you get into this week. Brian, where you been, buddy? You definitely are only... <laughs> Mirazel. You've definitely only been here uh, infrequently. Um, I guess I'll discard one of the five drops. Probably Nat Nat's elite. Oh, all right. Well, that's that's cool. I guess we don't actually have to do that, huh? Brian, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Kerwa, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You guys are great. Preaches all around. You get a preach. 
You get a preach. Why did the donation say my name? I, uh, I have no idea. I didn't make it do anything. Did you enter your name? I have no control over these things. Here's a bit of play for Dang it. Can't do anything. I can play it of the Horrid Swarm, but it just doesn't feel like a better value than just keeping Shrill Guy on the board. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. You know, that's, that's a Seinfeld song. You ever watched Seinfeld? You ever seen that show before? No, man, I've never seen a single episode of Seinfeld in my life. That's kind of weird. You should probably watch an episode of Seinfeld at some point, my dude. So here's what's going to happen. Are you guys ready? Give me a sign. Shrill howler one more time. Here we go. Oh, Pax Disdain. I kind of just want to pump this guy now. I think this card is actually... Oh, man, if we had the, if we still had this, we could kill this guy. And But then they just named Minotaur something, so... Yeah, this is actually fine. Take six. Seems good. Uh, we can't flip, but it's cost six to flip, so we are one shy. That would have been good, though. I also don't think they would have played into that. But maybe they would have. What do I know? My B. <laughs> wow, B-E. That's actually pretty funny. Hey, that's actually uh, pretty funny. Are they going to kill this dude? No. You're going to give me a... Oh, they are. Well, that's sad. Man, that guy was really scary for them, apparently. Do I want to kill their green or just... I think I just want to kill their green. They're also at eight. Also, sacrificing this to this and paying two for it is pretty nice. Let's draw a forge. Let's draw a fester hide. Fester hide boar here. That'd be gas. Uh, that is playable. We just attack, and then it, like I mean, if they if they want to block, it's fine. I'll take out their flyer, sure. Yeah, I didn't think so. All right, so we're gonna play not you. We're gonna play you. Sack this. Pay two. Play harpy. And we're way ahead. Guess I did it again. I did know the cost. This is you. Kingpin's pet? Well, just the the derpy face. Wow. Got him. Jester, have a good afternoon, buddy. I think it finally stopped raining. That's what you think. It's Florida. It never really stops. I'm not going to actually play the Vastwood Gorger because if they have any of their spells, I just don't want to like have it three for one or four for one or seven for one or whatever. So, so you're just getting one dude back. Sounds good. Two. Got that lethal. Yep, there it is. Oh, it's sack another creature, and that's worse. I was hoping I could sack itself to put it in the graveyard because that's where I want my things, but. Yep. 
what's it like always having it? It's got it's got to feel good, right? I can only imagine. <laughs> yeah, it's just something. All right, well, this dude's lethal. Hey, they didn't always have it that time. Got him. Bjorn, what's going on, buddy? It's your boy. Raining again. Told you. Told you it never stops. You just think it does. Got lost in the game. I still believe. Where does Batman live? Gotham. Gotham. <laughs> oh, look, we get this uh, this shrill howler again. This hand's asking good. I hand's not good. I'm going to shrill all over him. You ready? Mm -hmm. Are you ready? Okay. I need you to be ready. I'm getting here. prepared. Emotionally? Are strap you emotional? All right, strap in. Oh, I like your, your two three, bro. You can't block my howler. No, I don't care about it at all. This werewolf horror became an Eldrazi werewolf with this one trick. Eldrazi titans hate him. It'll blow your mind. <laughs> Number five. <laughs> you hear that, dude? Number six on this list will make you shit your pants. <laughs> That's true, it will. How much damage do we want to take? I don't think we want to... Watch during the top terminus. You ready? No, they didn't. Thank goodness. I was ready. I was ready for it. It's okay. I'm sure I'll have a removal spell of some kind. Maybe you're right, Michael. I mean, they're like, this guy only gets in two attacks anyway, so. So who even cares? They just plus and no sacrifice. <sighs> oh my god. I just assume they have either austere command or the other one, terminus in hand, so but if they don't uh -huh. cool color bottom fantastic we did not win but they get crappy cards so I assume they're going to put that on the bottom yeah here we go oh thank goodness and they could I think it was just draw the yellow steer command as well so doesn't it cost six though yes yes it does I still believe. Still believe. When I'm not with you, I lose my mind. They just sack a land? Wow, they're getting further from the terminus. Uh, oh, now they just replace it. It's okay. It's their, they're back again. Welcome back. Oh, they also floated once, so now they can play the austere command. Oh, they're just going to kill everything now, right? No, this guy. All right, well. Boom, 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 boom. 
Selling creatures every single time, but here we are. I have to get rid of this, so. If you got any superpower, what would it be? It's a good question. Any superpower? Hmm. <laughs> How about the superpower of staying awake for more than two hours? Yeah, that'd be so good. That's a good I'd one. I like that one. That's a good one. Just gonna keep sacking lands here. Oh, I guess so. I mean, I have seven cards, but not doing anything. So, I think I'd go with super speed. Really? Mm -hmm. Really? Sure. What about you? You know. I don't. You know. But I don't. But you do. But I don't. That's nice. Wow. Uh, sure. I'm gonna grow with this guy because I'm just tired of this Baraska. So that should take care of a good amount of their their treacheries. All the pirates are free. Yep, that's why I keep these I lands like in hand. I become invisible so I can spy on people. Be that's the best spy ever. I want to be the very best spy that no one ever was. The sad thing is, as soon as we play this Crawl Harpooner, they're going to just wipe the board. Are you just going to keep getting... I don't understand that. That's a weird block, but all right. Why did you take four instead of two? I'm confused. Ah, I see. So you two for one yourself. You done two for one yourself. The power that's... Have you ever considered doing soundtracks? I don't know what that means, but no. No, I have not. I might have waited. I might have waited on the sack there. That's how you sound, Morgan. Just so you know. It's weird how when you talk like that, you adopt the Melvin voice. It's weird how when you talk like that, you adopt the Melvin voice. What about that? Got him. I guess we can play Crawl Harpooner now because we have a nice backup plan if they want to wipe it all away. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah, I don't know. I guess we could have left this a 3-4 and this a 4-4. Four, four. Uh, that was definitely an option. All right, at the beginning of your upkeep, put a 1-1 one, one counter on Necoplasm. At the beginning of your end step, destroy each creature... With converted mana is equal to the number of one encounters. At the beginning of your upkeep, put one encounter on it. At the beginning of your end step. So it gets to destroy two drops, and one drops, two drops, and three drops. Well, now I'm now see now we're glad we didn't. And you can dredge it back. That's a weird card. I will battle across the land. Certain Michael B. Poke Mike, my heart's so true. I'm gonna pump this guy too. Gonna eat your thing, oh yeah. I'm gonna pass the turn. Gonna catch them all, Poke Mike. Alright, so it's gonna be Pokeman. 
aggressive. Are you wiping the board here? No. All right, that was weird. Did you think this guy was going to die? Hmm. Clearly saw something. I think they might have just thought we... I mean, we can't attack with the vampire here, so... Do we deal two or six and put them to two? Hmm. I, I might assume they have something here, so I'm actually just going to deal with two. And then we're just going to play Wild Wanderer. Do you want to mark in his beard choices? Do you like, I, he, he's, a, he's his own man. Mike is just a, a Mike in a bowl of lettuce and raw fish. That's literally just... I've been bearding since I was... No. 15. No. I used to grow it out really long, and it would curl. <laughs> it wasn't a good look, though. Curly beards don't look good. Speak for yourself. That's what exactly what I was doing. Good. What's the spell in your hand? Can you really not see it? It's a basswood gorger. It's probably behind my head. Oh, it, that's literally what it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, here, I'll move it like this. All right, so this now guy's dead. Peek. But now we get to attack, so that's cool. I really wish I could just discard these cards with this vampire in play. We have exiled seven cards, which means we've actually attacked seven times with this dude. Wow, that's nice. Sure. Here comes Terminus. Right on time. Okay. Whatever happened to Mike dyeing his hair pink? I don't think we ever came to a con concession with that. A concession? We didn't, what, concede it? <laughs> that's interesting. Yeah. I think you might mean consensus, but... That may have been what I may have Maybe! Been. So this guy is just dead? It just kills itself? Yeah, well, no block. Oh, you have no cards in hand? Oh, but then he just gives it lifelink? Yeah, so we're just going to block here. There's no reason to take four damage. Oh, that's nuts. The demon in me. That's really good. Um, one, two, three, four, five. But now they're gonna hit it because it's like it's got to be. It's got to be top deck on top deck. You gotta be kidding me. What? They stopped on the draw step. Oh, did they just troll us there? Because that's hilarious if they did. Wow. Hey, we actually won that match. Oh, wow. They played the three drop. Yeah, I didn't even realize that. I didn't even realize the necro guy was going to actually, the the invoker would, would have died. That's actually really interesting. So this is what I mean. Like, there's a lot of interesting interactions. Like, those, those two cards should never exist together. But it doesn't matter because it could have been any, any three drop. I just didn't actually. I haven't seen Necroplasm in like 15,000 years. Michael B. Necronaut normally not being a set with other three jobs. Yeah, that's, I was trying to, uh, I, like, I was trying to avoid <laughs> saying that. Let's mulligan. Does it work across 3B? I thought it was 3. I thought they were all cost like 3. Invoker. I'm just going to look it up. No, it's 3. Keep for sure. Bottom that. G2G. This is a good hand. It's not bad. It's good. I said it's not bad. I said it's good. It doesn't do anything until turn four, though. What do you do? Nothing. Stay black and attack. Wow. Thank he's, you. He's a good boy. That'll wake me up. Mm. 
Nothing will help wake you up. Oh, here, I got you. Oh. Oh. It's like a refreshing, cool mint. It's, it's, give him a nice little spritz. Oh, we got a Dirkwood Bailoth? Yikes. That is what's known as the yikes for me, dog. It's taking so long. What's the hold up here? Peter Jr.? Oh, how about Indian food? Indian sounds real good, too. Dang. Really? Yeah, does any not sound good? No, I, I like that idea a lot, but I'm surprised that you're going to make it because you make it by yourself. I do make Indian a lot, yeah. So it's I go out less and get it. Is Indian is a little on the pricey side if you don't make it at home. I agree. For me, I get like five days worth of food out of it. Wow, fucking Sarfarm Hybrid and Dirkwood Bailoth. Jesus. And we can't cast this with our three mana and all everything else costs at least four, so that's cool. Just a touch of lime juice. Hey, man, keep your eyes open. Cool. It's about par for the course. <sighs> cool. Well, so far we've drawn all of our high curve. I mean, if we can go land next turn, play this guy, block here. What is this? Oh, you just literally flash in a 3-2 flying trample that draw, gains you life every time you draw. Yeah, that seems good. Every card you've played is above average. Mike needs frosted tips. Yes, let's do that for sure. I mean, if we can get to Plague Wind Mana, I'm feeling okay with this, this match. But, I, you know, for some reason, I really don't feel like it's going to happen. What gave you that impression? Uh, the imminent death that we're facing. The imminent death. Behold, I am the imminent death. You're not anything but stupid. Wow. Got him. That was rude, man. Well, suck it. That was freaking rude. Killed it. I'm going to block here because it forces them to use their turn pumping, but we're also going to three, so... Uh, don't really matter that much because this guy's also going to kill us so if we kill this we literally have nothing to do against these two so uh, yeah uh, yeah okay good games good games hmm. I hope to learn what I'm doing wrong when I watch your video you won't you're doing quite well um I don't think there's anything inherently wrong. I think we're just gonna submit. Yep, the big fan. That's how you know that's how you know the death is coming. Remember the time we were like four mana shy of Plague Wind? I do. I feel like it was recently. It, oh god, this hand is just also not good. Sure. A black any black mana here is good. Well, they went to 6 too. Alright, I'm going to keep that anyway just because land is also just good. Crawl Warrior is like a, <laughs> like a poor man's Sauroform hybrid. I'm like, oh, I can spend 6 mana to make my guy permanent 6-6. Six, six. I can spend six mana to make my guy plus three plus three, which isn't even which isn't even close to your adapt, to be quite honest. Let's just get in there. They're not blocking because their guy's a thousand percent better. Jesus. <sighs> Any swamp here would be great. It's okay, all we can, all we have to do is draw one swamp. But they never did draw that one swamp. Oh my god. It's all happening. I can't even handle it. Wow. Oh, that's not the one I wanted. It's got the two for there. Uh, I kind of just want to play this. I don't really care about the lingering tormentor here. I'd rather just get deeper in.
interesting. Okay, well, I don't want any of these. Put two of them into your hand and the other into the graveyard. Whew. All right, well, God, I guess we're just putting Plague Wind into the graveyard, which feels really bad. I think we actually just keep the Plague Wind. And the Gorger, I don't think the Targer I care about. And we're probably gonna hit land here because we haven't, so that's good. Okay, we're getting there. I feel like Plague Wind is just a card where, like, if we do get to a point where we Plague Wind, we just can't lose. Yeah, one sided wraths are pretty good. Yeah, you're right. Shut up and take my money. I've been reading the YouTube comments, and several people have been saying that this guy needs to wear a shirt as a hat. <laughs> you know, I'm not sure if that's true. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna attack with these two, and if you want to block, I will pump. I think that's fine. Okay, they changed their mind. They're like, no, nah, I'm good. Oh, they didn't. They changed it back. If only that was a permanent change. Oh wow. Just snapping it off there, huh? Okay. Well, it doesn't. Fear is a good a good thing. So this is at least two attacks with this guy. So that's eight damage, my dude. My did name. you hear the hot? Yeah. Did you hear how the new how it worked out? What do you What do you mean? They haven't tested it yet, right? They're testing it in in London. Yeah, that's good. Give me a reason to block with this guy. Just give me a reason. Just give me a reason. Give me just... Oh, Jesus. Oh. A Galta, huh? Well. See you later. This little light of mine... I'm gonna let it shine. Alright, well, we have a lot of blocky boys. Those blocky boys are at it again. Does it also have trample? I believe it does, right? Oh yeah, it's just buried underneath the, the wall of cost reduction text. Oh, just that guy? Hmm. I'm just gonna block with this, because if they have like plus four, plus four, I don't want to die exactly, so... I'll risk a plus five, plus five. I won't risk a plus four, plus four. Sure. That's annoying. It's like we actually have enough to deal with Galta if we block it with everything and we're like one land away from a, from a plague wind. Five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. We can just block with all these things. This is this is kind of sad. Like one spider with spider spawning actually prevents us from just winning. Um, five, six, seven, eight, nine, silly. ten, eleven. Block here. Wait, aren't they just dead? How are they dead? They okay. Well, you mean it's alpha? Yeah. Yeah, probably actually. Yeah, that's a good call. Oh, or they have something. I have another thing. Jesus. Oh, for come on. God, I wonder what that's like. <laughs> Oh, they never don't have it, you see. God, they really never don't, do they? Anyway. 
Like you said in chat, world's most impressive fire fan, but like it's literally the thing that kept you alive. Yeah, I mean it's pretty impressive. Yep, and we're literally one turn away from just plague winding here. Yep, we're done. Cool. Like it has, it just literally had to untap your guy. You literally had to have a trick that untaps. So that's frustrating. Magic is frustrating. I guess I shouldn't have told you alpha. Yeah, you messed up, man. Yeah, I didn't see the untap your guy spell coming. I'm an idiot, clearly. I mean, it should have been hard to play around as well because they can just give Galt a plus two, plus two. So if we're playing around like blocking to go to one or something, they just kill us. So it's like, it's really hard to play around that. I guess we're dead either way. Which is sad. Yeah, it's funny because the spider spawning actually didn't even need to be there then. Mike, do you wear me undies? No, I wear my un my underwear. When was the last time you bought underwear? Probably like a year ago. You bought underwear a year ago? Yeah. I doubt it. I think you're just laying that just because you don't want to be embarrassed because you probably have like 10-year-old underwear. I have no 10-year-old underwear. I bet you do. I mean, maybe. There might have been a pair that's a... I mean, as, l as long as they work, they work. What well, define work? They're not broken. Hmm. You clean them, you wash them, put them in the soap. <laughs> Not in that order necessarily. Uh, yeah, I feel like the soap probably has to go first because that's, you know, just how it works. All right, here we go again. Mulligan. Sure. Oh, that's actually a good one. I like that. I like a little shrilly boy. It puts the unders in the soap or it gets the hose again. That's what I always say. Are you doing Morse code? Yeah. Okay. Uh, add two mana. Uh, spend it only to cast artifacts or activate artifact abilities. Joke's on you. You probably don't have any artifacts. They do. They got like 30 artifacts. Yeah, I should it. play a uh, warm color engine here and break us. Yeah, you can get a onesie as well. You don't have to just get underwear, man. You can get a onesie. You like Rakens? Yeah, I love Rakens. Okay. I actually feel like this guy is probably going to survive and do quite well against the blue white deck, but. Assuming they don't go land warm color engine. Well, they would need to do war land land because worm coal costs six. They missed the oh, land drop. Yeah, you're right. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. They have now missed multiple land droops. Oh hi, Mark. So now we're just going to play old Tormenti, Tormentor Reno. How many subs do you need to get Mike to model me, me on these on stream? You got to ask him. I think that's against the terms of service. Thank you. Why would it be against the terms of service? Because I'd be modeling underwear. Okay. Yeah, but you. what is this that you just added to this guy? Uh, it's got vigilance and flying. So it just says flying? Sure, I'll take it. I'll take it. I feel like we're winning this race. Haven't we attacked with this guy for like three times? Did they gain life? Did we miss an attack? Turn four. Oh, it's turn five now. So we attacked once last turn. Okay. I feel like we've been attacking with this guy for like a year. What do we have to reveal? A green card? Yeah, okay. Green creature or green card? Green card, okay. Nobody said you had to be just in your underwear. Well, then how are they going to know? Get though? your mind out of the gutter. How are they going to know about the, the product? <laughs> how are you going to know about your face? Got him. Hmm. I didn't think of that. Yeah, but you should have. Because, you know. Go on. Reasons. Oh, what? <laughs> wow, that was fast.
this little mic of mine. I'm going to let him shine. All right, I, I want... I kicked you into sideboarding and then said begin sideboarding. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, uh, it's a top tier thing. I will Hopefully I can big fan you. <laughs> I literally lost the last round of the big fan, so good times. Peter Jr., you just actually killed me last round, and uh, you big fanned me, so that's... <laughs> oh, man, good times. Uh, the tw the fifteen hour stream with Elk Tears is probably going to be next Wednesday, I believe. Yeah, I'll just play two two here. Get in there, little ratty boy. Oh, ratty boy! I oh, get knocked down. I remember I did that, and you were like, "Why? Why are you singing both those yeah, songs?" Yeah, that was I good. Know. I'm well aware. Yeah, that was good stuff. I was like, do you not even know how... Whoa. What is that thing? That's a long fin whale. It can only block creatures with flying. So we are in the clear, as the French say. Do the French say that? I don't know why they wouldn't. How often? I mean, whenever... It, how often do the French say that? I'm trying to tell you, whenever it's relevant. Whenever they need to say, in the clear, they say it. It's not like every day, I imagine. But when they are in the clear, they'll let you know. Is that right before they make the... Uh Head cheese? I don't think the French are responsible for the head cheese. I think they just make regular cheese. No, they make head cheese. Prove it. What are I'm you doing? That. Why, do, why are you touching the mic? I don't, just don't worry about it. I am worried about it. <laughs> Mike's like this. He's like touching the mic, and I'm like, why are you doing this? I just like to touch all the mic, you know? Wow, this is a lot of RAM. Travelers Amulet, mean, Manolith, Island. Utopia sprawl, urban utopia, and fertile ground. There's a lot going on up here. I like the touch of the mag. Wow, that was that was a solid Scientology reference there. One, two, three, four, five, six. They have seven mana. That's pretty good. I got greedy on pack three, pick five. That's an interesting. That's real specific. How do I make it so I can see chat in games? I mean, I think you gotta come down here and you're like, hide chat, ignore chat. And then if your chat isn't up, I always keep mine up. You can go show chat and then chat shows up. And then you can also go to show game log and then that shows up too. And I just keep them both up because it's just easier. Oh, look at that one six boy. Look at that little cutie boy. Hey, cutie boy. Are we just going to die to the sky well? Die to the sky. Well. I knew you were going to say last podcast on the left. I knew it. I was like, all right, she's so probably listening to this last podcast on the left. Had a good feeling. All right, we're just gonna play this guy. Wait, what's going on? I think my mouse just died. I gotta find the cord, which is one of these. Whoop. There we go. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. And we get rid of the two mana ones. Yeah, we're probably getting rid of one of these. What is this? That's not a ramp one though. So this is this is the ramp one, right? Yeah. Let's get rid of that. Sure. Crack the amulato. Look how many death touch boys we got here. One. Two. Okay. Well, those death touch boys are at it again. A three. No, just two. 
A four. No, there's not. There's not, but there's not four. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me finish. Five. Okay. Six. Seven. But can you, hold on. But wait, can you stop? Can I finish? Can I just, can I finish? Seven. Eight. Nine. Jesus. It's actually painful, but. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's lethal. So you got to chump here as well. You can probably trade with the rat. Trade with the rat and you're to blame. Trade with the rat and you're to blame. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Chicken to China and the Chinese chicken, Michael. Have a drumstick and your brain starts ticking. <laughs> Michael's learning math on stream. This is amazing. Yeah, you guys are watching him grow up right in front of your very eyes. This is where they go titanic growth on this guy and just kill us with one long fin sky whale that they put on turn four or turn three. Are you ready? I'm waiting. They're at one, too. They're, they have 12 life? Can I, <laughs> I hate you so much. I wish I could target them with this. Target player looks at the top three cards, puts two of them into the hand, and then discards the other. That deals two damage to that player. I'm gonna say good games because I think they're probably typing something right now. That's my that's that acidic slime killed me. There you go, there you go. Acidic slime kills everybody. Oh boy, oh boy. Now we're gonna it's gonna knock us out to the old two one. That was not terrible. I'm gonna say good games. I thought we had a whole other match. No, dude, you don't even know how matches work. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Send those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Twitch and Patreon. Meundies.com slash Frank Lepore. All the links are in the description below if you want to support the channel in any way. And I really appreciate it so much. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.